Hello everyone, welcome back to Diesel Place Arc. Thank you all so much for tuning in to me once again. Christmas is coming up, guys. It's like in a few days' time. So I was actually thinking that we should go and get ourselves that that reindeer looking dino, the mega something. Can't remember his name. But we're gonna get go go over to the snow biome. And it's getting a little bit foggy right now. We're gonna get him team up, and we're also gonna get a Fiumia, guys. I know it's like the basic dino, but I think we need to get some fertilizer going because um, we need sweet, we need vegetables actually. You know, we need vegetables. So on the ship, I gotta find some place. I think the medium uh, crop uh, plot would be good. Right, we gotta. Do we have this? Is it dropping? Oh, is it already there? Alright. Oh, there's somebody in space here. Hopefully there's no turrets. Oh, Quetzal. What level are you, Quetzal? Let's just see. Oh, level 32. Right, we'll give, we will give this Quetzal a miss. Let's move over to the snow biome. And hopefully we don't become too cold because I'm on my Batman outfit right now. <laughs> I think we, we should also um, paint this uh, Argentavis right here. So if you guys watched the previous episode, I actually taught you guys how we can actually go about it. And this arctemplates.com website where people have already placed the templates of all the paintings. You just got to download it, go and get uh, the colorings ready, place it in the, f the file in the folder of my paintings so check out the my previous videos and i'll actually go through it with you guys so it's pretty awesome but okay this is level 32 we'll give him a miss right now we can't afford to get t-rex guys you know i know that we are actually moving out in our sea base so we can't have uh, mammoth we can't have um what's it called we can't have large dinos actually oh that's a calico terror what, what level are you reindeer what level are you We're trying to look for let's see i'm not too sure if his color will actually suit maybe it would maybe it would we don't need a very high level guy we just need rudolph <laughs> You're level 32. Yeah, we'll just do it, guys. We'll just do it. Right. Oh, there's another one there. What level are you? You're level 80. And he's about the same color. We're gonna go for a level 80 guy. We're gonna go for him. Yep. We're gonna bring him back. And we're also gonna find uh, Fiomia. And we're gonna go and get it uh, tamed up. So, be right back. Alright guys, so I flew around and I was pretty lucky. We actually found another level 136 uh, Megaloceros. <laughs> and uh, Walfiomir, who is level 168. So this guy is going to be Rudolph and level 80 is going to die. So we're going to take our... I think it's daytime now, right? That's why this guy is a little bit slow. Uh, yep. <laughs> okay, he's gonna go in sleep and let's see. We still have our Fiomia and we have our Megalosaurus. So before we tame them, I'm just gonna uh, whistle passive to all so that uh, none of the dinos attack them. And I'm gonna show you guys an amazing mod. Right, this mod is actually called the Photon Rifle and Photon Core. So I already have one and 60 rifle core. Well, then we're running low on uh, resources. So we're gonna quickly farm some later, but for now I'm just gonna show you guys the Photon Rifle. So we're gonna go craft the Ingram. Once you got the Ingram, for crafting you actually need Angler Gel, Metal Ingot, Obsidian, and Crystal. And then for one photon core, you need uh, 
50 photon batteries and then 50 crystals 25 silica pearls 25 obsidian and yeah so one of the core actually requires 50 photon batteries and for one photon batteries you actually need 200 all 150 anglo gel 100 crystals and 80 polymer i know it's a little bit expensive guys but you know what we are in uh boosted server so isn't it bad so the photon rifle core is the ammunition for the photon rifle and if you guys don't have it yeah go ahead with the normal trank arrows and the crossbows it will exactly the exactly the same so let's go I think we have major berries over here yep we do okay, we're just gonna quickly shrank both of these guys down whoa, whoa, whoa. what's happening all right it's daytime right now I'm gonna just go. he's running he's running but he got nowhere to run okay he's down with two shots let's just see Sarko is blocking the way but it's all right it's all right and one hit <laughs> that's how powerful it is guys all right so we're just gonna get uh some major berries we don't need so much all right so 800 and let's see he's gonna put in some into the fuel mirror okay and we're gonna put in some into rudolph whoops sarko has to move out of the way Gonna put Sarko. Can Sarko move? Can Sarko go? Okay, Sarko can just be there. Okay, we're just gonna take half of this. He should be taming up pretty fast. Alright, and for Rudolph, we just place it inside here. And he should also be taming up. Monkey business, come with me. Keep Siren and company. And we're just gonna quickly return back the photon core and the photon rifle. So next up what we have to do is that I was thinking of Right, we have flesh. Doesn't it look amazing guys? <laughs> right, we're gonna just place flesh beside Shogun. So just check out my previous episode guys on how to actually paint this guys. Okay. We need to place um, medium plant crops, right? I was thinking that, you know, I'm going to like place one here, another there, and let's see, maybe one here. I don't know. I don't know. We, we, we have to find place. Maybe I can place it at the back, actually, right? Maybe I can just place one here and i will place one right over here right throne is airborne so for medium plot let's see what do we need for medium plot we need wood tash fiber and stone so we're just gonna make four of them let's see very very great where did I place the wood? I think it should be in here. Now we have the wood, we have the fiber. Do we have tash? Oh no. I think we ran out of tash. Okay, we have some tash over here. Okay, we need lots more tash. Oh, okay. And stole. Oops, I think I had stone up there. Let me just check it out. We have stone here. Yep. So, we're gonna just craft two medium. Uh, sorry, four. One, two, three, four. I think that's enough. Okay. Then we're gonna move up here. Yeah. So I'm just gonna place one here, it snaps perfectly, exactly what we need, and place one here, let's head to the back, it seems to be protruding out a little bit, 
Alright, throne. Come here, throne. You can just move throne a little bit over here. I'm just gonna get down here. Let's see, can we actually pick this up? Wooden ceiling. Yeah, let's pick the wooden ceiling up. Alright, and then I'm just gonna put place back the wooden ceiling to make it make it a little bit flushed. Ooh, oops. Oops. Right, I thought it worked just now. Let's give it a try again. Uh huh. So it works. It's just that this one is sticking up a bit, but I think we can live with that, guys. So I'm gonna place one here, and I'm gonna place one here. All right. So next up, what we have to do is that we need to make uh, pipings, right? Um, let me just see. We need water pipes. Pipe. We just go with stone. So. Mm hmm. We need taps for sure, so I'm just gonna make two, three, four, four taps. That's what we need. Mm -hmm. This is the irrigation intake. I don't know how this is gonna work, guys. Because usually the pipes are stationary. So I'm not too sure if we can have pipes on the ship. Hmm. I'm gonna just make one pipe and make one pipe incline. Let's make an intake. And let's make one vertical. So we have everything here, one of each, and then we can actually see how it actually works. So I've tamed a Fiomia, what should we name Fiomia? Alright, we're gonna name Fiomia Shitload. <laughs> Alright. So there's no snap point. Ah, there is. There is a snap point here for this one. Okay, nice. So the straight one works as in this one. Oh yeah, it does. Okay. So we're gonna just place the vertical one. Okay, let me just move it here. Somewhere here. Like this. And then let's see, do we have like a can we just place this one here? Oh, I saw, I saw it, I, I saw the tap, we can place the tap, okay, nice, okay, so, we have the incline, and then we have the intake, so we have the incline, okay, I'm just gonna place the incline, let me just see what do we need, we need the straight ones, right, no, that's the, no, no that's the intake, let me just see, we need number five. We place we need number five here. Hopefully, there's nothing there. All right. We're gonna place another one there like that. Another one there like that. And okay, we will need throne right now. We need throne. I'm gonna make a run for it. Can we get thrown? Can we get to thrown? Okay guys. So we gotta make the we got to go the long way around. So we're gonna come into here, we're gonna grab right this, we're gonna grab the grappling hook. Alright, let's head back up. Refumia. Right, just stay there. Are you tamed yet? Is your topper okay? Okay, you're half done. You should be okay. He's gonna leave Fiomia there. I'm gonna climb. Let's see.
and then we're gonna ride it. All right, nice. We're gonna come over. Oh, we need lots more actually. Over here a little bit more. Okay. Let's jump. All right, we gotta remove this. I'm just gonna remove this. So oh, I'm starving. Okay. Where is it? All right, we need to. Let's see, we need maybe one more, two more. That's the intake, right? Requires connection to the water. Can you connect to the water here? No? Alright, maybe we need one more. Let's do one more. And... Alright, we need the connection to the water. Uh-huh. Okay. So we have done this connection right here. Oh, guys, look at that. <laughs> so we got it going on. So what I'm going to do right now is... Oops. Set back up to throw. Can we do this again? I guess we got to do this again. We're going to do this. We're going to get control. Alright. So what I'm going to do right now is that I'm going to go over to the other three and then get some food and we are going to be right back. So we've already completed uh, four of the medium plant crop that we did just now. All of them are actually equipped with the pipes and also water so it's all good. So, down here at the bottom, Rudolph and the shitload <laughs> has been uh, tamed up. So, I'm just going to show you guys another mod. Alright, it's night time right now. So, I'm just going to come up here and then there is this place called the cell shop and the paint shop. So, just go over to the cell shop and for example, let me just see. I'm just going to drop a 12 of those metal ingots. And it actually turns to turns to gold pearls. And we just grab the gold pearls, and I'm just gonna put the gold pearls over here like this. And then I can actually just buy whatever color I need. So, for example, let's see if we are going to pay a shitload. So I'm gonna hit him, and like what I actually did it during the during my previous videos, I've already have a file called drowsy xx down here so it has the pain that we actually require i've already acquired it so what we're gonna do right now is that we are going to load this pain with the pain. we're gonna select it we're gonna paint him all right for those guys who do not know who is drowsy check out pokemon guys it's a pokemon <laughs> all right so drowsy is done let's see oh drowsy looks amazing Right, I think it's going to look even amazing during the daytime. Alright, let's go over to Rudolph. Alright, and then we have the same for Rudolph. We have the Spirit Stack. So we have all the colorings down here. I've already made them. Let me just paint it. So there you go, guys. There is Rudolph. Oh man, <laughs> doesn't it look amazing? All right, let's just go over here, change his name, and we're gonna call him Rudolph. Like this, and for this one, we have to change the name right now. You're not gonna be shitload anymore. You're gonna be Rousey. All right. So we have Drowsy and we have Rudolph. Alright, so back to the uh, plant crops up there. It's getting a little bit dark down here. I'm going to start recording again once it's daytime. But what we're going to do next is that we're going to bring our patchy rhino and we're going to do a little bit of farming, guys. Right, we need uh, some berries and also we need some seeds. Like the wrong grass, several root, rock root, and stuff like that. And we're gonna get we gotta get them and we're gonna start things up. We also need some tash so that we can actually get uh, 
a little bit of fur. Okay, we got a stash down here. Let's get a pretty stash on it. But we're gonna get some tash and then also some steam berries to get the drowsy to poop and get the compost bin going on. So, be right back. 